everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to the Minecraft mod reveal with me. And today, today, it's been a little while, but we're looking at Wi Fi Craft again. Which, um, yeah, I noticed it updated. Then, after looking at it, fell that I noticed it updated another time and hadn't noticed that update. So, it's been two updates since I last looked at this mod. AK, some new waifus have been added, new outfits have been added, some new features have been added. Cool! Let's take a look, see, look. So, right, just to say off the bat, I've already looked over, like, all of them individually. So, bar the new ones and some new updated things, like, I'm not going to go through each one individually again. If you want to see more details of, like, a bunch of the other ones, there's the old video for that. I'll link it down below. But other than that, yeah, we're going to look at new stuff today and that. And just, just so the video's not super, super long, because we've been through them all before. But, um... Right, just quickly glancing over some of the other items and that, and then seeing some of the bits that changed in them. Starting us off, yeah, book of love, still the same. Poppy, book, uh, da, da, da. get your book. Summon your wife through using levels. The Yu Shebang's still there for that. Uh, I think one of the things was Megamine's picture got altered, and her hat got altered, so that like, the picture fit better, and Megamine's hat didn't clip or something, something, something. So that's so well and fine, that's so normal. The waifu ring, creative ring, potion of love, and the waifu said, none of that's changed, that's all still the same. So he's got a bunch of different items from, for various characters, from various characters, depending on the character, and da da da, you know, there's gonna give you staff, Torga's book on. Uh, roasted dragon ring, bubbly for aqua, straw hat from Nami, grilled thingy, miso soup, a microphone from Miku. Uh, which, and yeah, I think it was you, wasn't it? Was, uh, whatever your name was. I think you were the one, you act as like a shop. Yeah, my mommy's shop is on my open night. Yeah, and she could, you could buy and sell things to her. Dan, 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 cool. One thing it has been out though is the waifu one. So if we quickly grab, who are we going to grab for this test? We'll grab Yuno know, for this. Yuno's know, a fine one for this because you know, um, yeah, it's been, it's been a change to how this, this works. So, okay, first things first, we need to um, tame you. So we can use this on her to get our uh, inflation, our flexion, inflation, whatever the thing's called. Up to max, we have to give her tons of gifts and stuff. Then we can just give her a ring. Bum ba dum. Yeah, getting Yandere on side. That's definitely a good idea. Right, so from here, you can use the wife who wants. Once I let those messages go away. Uh, yeah, you can basically click the wife who wants and make it so your Yandere. Not specifically your Yandere, but you make it so they'll stay or they'll move, essentially. So that's the thing. Okay, that's better outfit. Also, right, I was trying to figure out, I was like, wait, what, where is this other section for this one? It's not working here. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, so, hitting life, it makes some stay or move. If you right-click while not aiming it, I don't know, you can, uh, teleport life is to kill, that's fine. You can delete them from there, reset them or whatever, that's fine. Toggle fighting's nothing. If you get someone who's aggressive, like, you know, here, and we grab a couple of zombies... If the zombies attack us. So she's currently stings because like, she won't move and fight or anything like that. If we let her fight though, she will attack the zombies and basically fight for us and all that. Yes. I thought you used to have an axe or something, but never mind. Uh, but yeah, so that is all well and good. She's followers, she'll fight for us. What if you don't want them to follow though? Toggle facing. She will no longer fight. Also, she's not healing. I thought these people, I thought they used to have like super quicker healing factor. I'm sure it's fine. Anyway, point being. Never gonna fight with a zombo. She will not help us. So a useful little thing if you don't want them going insane. Especially I guess if you get people like say Mega Beam. Because you know Mega Beam is a bit more chaotic than some of the other ones. Yeah, Mega Beam does stuff like that. She makes things explode, but you know, it does not get like destroyed the train or anything like that. But yeah, if you have other things nearby, you don't want getting blown up, like, you know, pets or people or something. Yeah, you might not want her doing that. So, a useful little feature. Useful little feature. Plus, you can just tell them to stay as well, which does the same thing, but yeah. But right, some small changes that have apparently happened. One of them being Nezuko. She now properly burns in daylight. Slash time set day. There we go. Nope, never mind. <laughs> She's slowly burning in daylight. Okay, uh, basically, I I just saw the update thing say there's going to have birds in daylight properly. Can I actually save her? There we go, put her in total form just so we don't accidentally kill her. Uh, yeah, okay, so that's nothing. She'll just consistently burn slowly over time. Bim -ba -dum. Fair enough. That's a thing. Uh, other, other thing, we've got Toru. Toru apparently also got a strange. Toru apparently got a new outfit. So if we go right click in here, skin. So I can't remember what our other skins were, so let's just quickly. Grab her, put her down. So she had, right, her other maid skin. Yep, cool. And skin number three. 
is uh oh yeah dragon farm <laughs> we're going with that okay no come back never get skin four which i have no idea what it is bop it is yeah, no, I've got no idea what one that is. I don't. Did I even watch the. I don't think I watched the last season of the, the Dragon Raid show, so I I possibly just don't have any idea what the set is. I haven't watched the first season in ages. Uh, but yeah, Taro's got a new skin then. Cool, whatever that is. Other other person, Sayori, she apparently also got a new skin thing. Cool. Oh yeah, it's currently locked. No, it's not. And skin, skin number two. I, I think they had... No, that's a casual outfit. Okay, is that the new one? Is that the is that the other one? I'm not sure, because I can't remember what she had before. I feel like she had a bikini outfit before. I feel like all the... Like, there was two of the Doki Doki Literature Club people in. A.K.A. the other one being a certain, um... Monica. And, uh, yeah, I think they both had bikini ones, didn't they? So she's not got a casual outfit. If you fancy, you know, having her wear that. But yeah, interestingly, it says for Taurus... Uh, updated skin thing. Apparently, it was like a contest winner thing. So I don't know. I'm guess, I guess it must, it, I might be, I don't know if it's like a Patreon thing or it's a Discord thing or something. But uh, yeah, I guess they're holding like a poll thing or like a suggestion raffle type thing to like pick skins and stuff out to or for ideas or maybe like, like putting out several ideas and just certain ideas. I don't know. Either way, I print my skins on different, very uh, different of the girls. So that's cool. Wow, I really stumbles through those last few words. Yeah, I'm like half asleep at this point. <laughs> oh, it's been a rough week for me at this point. I, th I just saw this update and I'm like, yeah, let's just do this. It's a nice relaxing thing to go and play around with. But yeah, anyway, new stuff. Other than, you know, that one. Let's go with the other horrible, horrible thing. Well, depends on your definition of horrible. The waifu killer, aka the waifu removal ones. So what does this do? Exactly what you think. Wah! She's gone forever. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, <laughs> so the point, the wife of one can get made with a stick and a book of love. And, you know, it's essentially part of, you know, it's something you'd want to have on hand for, you know, dealing with wifes and setting them to move, not move, fight, not fight, or teleport them to you and stuff if they're a little bit far away or trapped in something. Blah, blah, blah. This one can be crafted, it's created mode only. But a simple thing is, if you've accidentally summoned a waifu like Monica and you don't want her, you can get actually what happens if you use this on Monica. Because I remember what happens if you use, if you try to delete Monica in the traditional fashion, I remember what happens then. What happens if we try to kill her with this? Nothing! We murdered her! You know, it's probably a good thing we murder her because we've got Yuri here! Yeah, the kind of, um. And that's just okay. Yeah, they kind of added in the other two girls from the Doki Doki Literature Club. Like, I, I don't know if it's just the maker of the mods, like a fan of the game, which, you know, fair enough, a lot of people are a fan of the game because it's an interesting game. Uh, or, well, it was like a voted in thing. It's just a lot of people are fans of the game that are over there. But yeah, they completed the collection. They completed the collection, but they haven't added in Darkness yet. <laughs> They're kind of sick, the girls. Oh, they gave me an aqua right there. God damn it, people. Anyway. So, yeah, these two now exist. So, which one is this? This person. Cool. So, how does she work? Well, she'll say, hey, dummy, that's a thing. And I'm not cute. And why are you talking to me so much? Cool. So, yeah, if we go through the Book of Love. Wait, was she actually the next new one or was it the other one? There's Monica. There's Nami. Yeah, there is. Sayuri. Uh, so, she likes rose flower bish things. She likes books. She likes cookies. She dislikes leads. Oh god! <laughs> it took a moment to click, sir! Is that a reference to what I think it is? I assume that's a reference to what I think it is. Cool, yep, right, moving on, yep, cool. So, yeah, give her that stuff, the stuff she likes preferably. And keep she be your waifu. Cool, so we'll just quickly click on that. Just don't leave my side, dummy. You can call me cute, but only when we're alone and I don't love you or anything. Give her head pats so she's happy. Yep, cool. Uh, skins. She's got a second skin. I'm assuming it's a bikini one because the rest of the club had one. It's not. It's a casual outfit first. Okay. Cool. So they're just getting casual clothes. Nice. I just said I'd do this update, like, thinking it's going to be, like, you know, stressy. I'm not going to have to think about anything or that. Then just she appears. After seeing it was a Doki Doki crew getting put, I should have realised there was going to be dark references in there because it's Doki Doki Literature Club. Of course there is. But, yeah, anyway, so she's now following us around. Stop that. Uh, other one. Yuri. 
Kyo, she's nice-ish, and, uh, it's hard to say nice things about people from Toki Toki Literature Club because everything's twisted and evil there. Uh, anyway, so, um, hello, and Yuri is currently reading a book. She doesn't seem to notice your presence, and I'm sorry if I sometimes appear condescending or arrogant. I, I give my thoughts accurately. So it's been troublesome for me. Can you use less complicated words, please? I'm too tired for this. <laughs> God damn it. Anyway, Yuri, her next thing is... That is not... Wait, what? Yuri, she dislikes alcohol. She likes sword. She likes eyes of enter. And she likes books. Cool. Oh, it's nice to... Oh, she's there. She dislikes eyes. And she likes cakes and things. I was looking at Sayori. Because I'm pretty thinking of one untwisted thing. No. That's the key's the other one. Yeah, it's from also play Doki Doki for a reason. Uh, she likes cakes and books. Dislikes eyes. She dislikes alcohol but likes blade. Yep. Cool. Yep. 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 Different dark reference there. Uh, right. You get back here. There we go. I am not reading all of that. Thank you. <laughs> Don't click that on her. Uh, Maiden of Mystery. Ah, uh, what I would give for some wine, chocolate, a good fantasy book, and a heavy rain. Yep. Um, currently reading a book, she may suggest to me to read with her. Do you also think you and I finding each other had to be fight? Yep, cool. Right, I'm guessing you've got a casual outfit, right? Like, we've, we've been, I guess we've moved away from the bikini outfits, because I think a lot of the characters got bikini outfits, didn't they? And we've done to more casual outfits, which I'm fine with. Also, can you... Yeah, kill a comfy jumper, nice. So I'm assuming I still can't beat... Yeah, you still can't hurt the waifus. Yeah, that makes sense. Cool. Oh, wait, we're clicking them like that. We'll make them stay or follow. Yeah, cool. That's fine. But yeah, so those two get added in. And you might have briefly saw when I went past on my book. There was another person added in, a.k.a. I saw the name. Velvet. Which... I know, I haven't actually played the game she's a part of, but I have sought about a bunch. It looks cool, and she looks cool, so I've... There's that, but yeah, get Velvet from... What is the thing called again? It's something, 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 something. Tales of Beria. Yeah, I can't pronounce that well. Anyway, Anonymous, wait, what? 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 Duke of Shades? Oh, I'm assuming this is a pe the people that, like, commissioned that in the minor... Thing I had them in. I don't know. Ah, uh, she dislikes cake and flour. Dislikes nice things. Cool. She likes apples, compasses, and maps. Nice. I also assume she can fight. Right, come here, you. Do -do -do. A selfish person. I've trampled cities, destroyed towns, killed and devoured people. <laughs> and yet I still want more. I want to live a simple, happy life. You by my side. That's, yeah, these negative feelings I have. Fear, despair, hatred. They're proof. We're really alive. She really does like to talk, doesn't she? My good. Anyway, skin. Casual outfit. That outfit was... Ooh. I like the hair. I like the outfit. Yeah, it's casual outfit. Very nice. Very nice. Her battle outfit looks very good. I was saying battle outfit. What she was wearing was her battle outfit. Ow! <laughs> no! Oh, I love that. I love that that's a thing. She just thought, like, nice things. She tried to head pat her. She literally just hit you. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, yeah. There's also these things as well. The uh, Cocoa Cat Cupcake. Which is apparently... It's a new item given to you periodically by Natsuki. Says the thing for it. And it can be crafted by the player. So, like... Yeah, it's like making a cake. A.k.a. wheat. The food items. Cool. Uh, so, I guess you can get that offer. Any effects? Yes, help us from Terry instantly. Hello, get two hearts for eating that. Oh my god. What? It lasts a minute and it stacks. Oh my god! <laughs> you can just keep eating them. Oh, it stacks out the second row. Okay, fair enough. So you get help us five from eating these things. You just eat five of them and you get a minute of um, double health. That's very handy. That's a nice little item. Let's go. Cool. Also, wait, how strong are you in a fight now? I think about it. Um, slash time set one two six zero zero blah. Zombos, go velvet, go. Why are you not? There we go. Yeah, she's murdered them. Okay, yeah. So she's pretty strong. 
She has a regeneration buff. Oh, you did heal as well. When did you heal? <laughs> okay, so the, uh, if they do get injured, they will eventually heal. Good to know. Oh, it's such a fun little mod. Generally, this is just a nice little mod you can just throw in like any random 1.16.5 pack because realistically, unless you like, you know, if you make the book and like bring a life into existence, like it does nothing to your game. Like it does nothing, it just naturally spawns. It's just you optionally choose to bring this stuff into existence. And you're, they bring it into existence, you can leave, just leave them at home, like staying. <laughs> if you want to, or you can have them periodically, you know, you use ones that give you like specific items and things like that. Or if you just want Mega Beam's hat, which I would add it just for the hat. <laughs> like, I love getting clothes items, especially anime clothes items. I fucking love Mega Beam's hat. But yeah, this is just a lovely one. I do enjoy it when it gets little updates. And I do enjoy keeping an eye on it and doing little update videos on it. Because it's just neat. Well, we're not focusing on Doki Doki Literal Club anyway. It's a nice, lovely, little, friendly mod with just fun waifu things, different outfits, little things to saying, little gifts and items and stuff. It's a nice, friendly little mod. And then Monica and the Okie Dokie exist and fecking hell. Right, yeah, cool. <laughs> oh, dearie dear. But yeah, all the Doki... Wait, hold on. There was another Doki Doki game, wasn't there? I haven't played that one. I'm assuming all their characters added, though, right? Like, there's not going to be more Doki Doki characters added, right? We're not we're on to back onto the friendly nice things. I mean, I see that. Velvet's not exactly friendly nice. <laughs> Actually, half the characters aren't really friendly nice when you think about it, but we don't question that bit. Oh, the ball. Right, anyway, people, for today, though, gonna end things there. Little short, lovely mod review. So, yeah, just it's a nice little mod. It's worth a look if you like, you know, various anime, waifu, girl things. But, yeah, uh, links down below if you want to check it out. Thank you all very much for watching. If you know any other anime mods you think you should take a look at or any mods of updated, so let us know in the comments down below. Because, yeah, I'm enjoying just flicking through random anime mods and things and doing little reviews of them. Pretty much what I've been doing all week, and it's been quite fun. But, yes, anyway, thank you all for watching. See you next time for whatever random anime mod thing I end up reviewing next. Go buy it from Bunny. Da, 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 da. Also, just want to say a quick thank you to all of the channel members for the extra support and a special thank you and shout out to our late members, the Johnny members, Sebastian Ramsey, Alexander01, and Isaac Washington, and our Anbu member, Monster Q. Thank you all very much for the extra awesome support. Butter, butter, butter.